Given how much SUVs are preferred over conventional automobiles in the UAE, their popularity never falls below the visible horizon. Of course, even in an easy-to-win market like this, there are certain models that easily come out on top. The last category of SUV comprises of automobiles that are adaptable enough to handle some off-road activities while still being very sporty in character. These are known as sports or performance SUVs, and they are typically manufactured by premium manufacturers, implying that they are posh and costly. Mercedes-AMG G63 The Mercedes-Benz G-Class is an SUV that will not look out of place whether it is in the desert or parked in front of Ritz-Carlton. The G-Wagon, as it is fondly known as, oozes of charisma and almost unbeatable off-roading prowess. Moreover, in the UAE, the G-Class is the vehicle of choice for members of various royal families. This, by default, elevates this SUV's status to a stratospheric level and makes it extremely desirable. Even though there are two main variants of the Mercedes-Benz G-Class, it is the AMG G63 that's actually the most popular one. The Mercedes-AMG G63 starts from around 695,000 Emirati dirhams, while the standard G500 is about 100,000 dirhams less expensive. In the UAE, Mercedes-Benz cars, including the G-Class, are sold primarily by either Gargish Enterprises or the Emirates Motor Company. Having said that, you can find several reasonably priced used cars in Raz Al Khaimah. While the G-Wagon has been around since the late 1970s, the latest model came into being in 2018. The boxy exterior of this SUV is as old as time itself, making it instantly recognizable as nothing other than a G-Wagon. Compared to some other 4x4s on this list, the Mercedes-Benz G-Class is not all that huge in size. Of course, that's not to say that it is small. The G-Class comes in at 4,817 mm in length, including the rear-mounted spare wheel, 1,931 mm in width, and 1,969 mm in height. On the other hand, the wheelbase measures 2,890 mm while boot capacity stands at a solid 667 liters. In terms of its color choices, the Mercedes-AMG G63 can be had in obsidian black, iridium silver, magnetite black, rubellite red, emerald green, jupiter red, night black magno etc. The G63 is characterized by its AMG-specific front grille, more aggressive bumpers, bolder-looking alloy wheels, and a bunch of AMG badges. Compared to the old model, the new G-Wagon's interior looks far more special and premium. Mercedes has kept the front grab handle, dedicated switches for the locking differentials, and the flattish design of the windows unchanged, the rest of this interior has been thoroughly updated. The modernization has led to Mercedes sticking its large dual digital screens to the dashboard of the G-Class, while also integrating better sound insulation, better materials, and a more convenient layout of switchgear. The Mercedes G-Class is still only a five-seater, but the cabin is now more comfortable and better built. Some of the most notable features of this SUV include adaptive LED headlamps, adaptive dampers, dynamic cruise control, keyless entry and go, multi-zone climate control, heated, ventilated and massaging front seats, a Burmester premium surround sound system, and a 12.3-inch touchscreen infotainment system with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The Mercedes-AMG G63 is crammed full of safety tech that includes up to 7 airbags, active lane keep assist, blind spot assist, active braking assist, electronic stability and traction control, isofix anchors, and a 360-degree camera system. Under the hood of the Mercedes-AMG G63 is a 4.0-liter twin-turbo V8 petrol engine that sends 585 horsepower and 850 newton-meters of torque to all four wheels via a 9-speed automatic gearbox. While that nose raises up and you get pushed into your seat, this brick-like unaerodynamic monolith will hit 240 kmph. Of course, with three independent locking differentials, a full-time 4WD system, a rigid rear axle, a tough body on frame construction and a computer-controlled low-range gearbox, the Mercedes-Benz G-Class is very capable off-road. Coming to its off-road metrics, the G-Wagon can wade water bodies up to 700 mm deep, while affording an approach angle of 30.9 degrees, a breakover angle of 25.7 degrees, and a departure angle of 29.9 degrees. And in its stock form, the Mercedes-Benz G-Class has a ground clearance of 241 mm. BMW X5 among the mid-size luxury SUVs, few names ring a bell as well as the BMW X5. When much of the world was focused on making SUVs practical and affordable for the whole family, the Bavarians were planning on making a sports utility vehicle that you would love to drive. Coming online in 1999, 
The BMW X5 invented the term SAV or sports activity vehicle, something the brand uses to this date. If BMW says its cars are a driver's machine, the likes of a sporty SUV worked in their favor. One of the premier distributors of BMW cars in the UAE is AGMC, which is present in the Emirates of Dubai and Abu Dhabi. The price of the BMW X5 in UAE starts from around 395,000 Emirati dirhams, with variants including the 40i X-Drive, 50i X-Drive, and the X5M competition. Meanwhile, AGMC also sells pre-owned BMW cars in Dubai. There are also many other second-hand cars in Um Alcan on Cars 24. Based on the brand's cluster architecture platform, the new BMW X5 measure 4,922mm in length, 2,004mm in width, and 1,748mm in height. The X5 usually houses five occupants and has a boot space of 645 liters. The BMW X5 in UAE is available in colors such as Alpine White, Arctic Grey, Black Sapphire, Mineral White, and Phytonic Blue. On the design front, the X5 gets BMW laser light headlamps, a large twin kidney grille, sporty front and rear bumpers, flared fenders, 20-inch M light alloy wheels, a sporty roof spoiler, wraparound LED tail lamps, and twin or quad rear exhausts. The BMW X5 really set the stage for future performance SUVs, and even its design is somewhat of a testament to vehicles of this kind. On the inside, the BMW X5 looks as premium and modern as the automaker claims it to be. The build quality is second to none, while the materials used really make this SAV stand apart from SUV cars in its segment. The driver-oriented layout of this cockpit brings a 12.3-inch touch infotainment display that gets Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, a 12.3-inch part digital driver's display, BMW's virtual assistant, a twin-pane sunroof, three-zone climate control, a 16-speaker Harman Kardon premium sound system, and BMW's digital key. This being a modern-day German car, the BMW X5 comes with loads of safety tech. Some of the most vital ones here include a full complement of airbags, dynamic stability and traction control, adaptive cruise control with pedestrian detection and auto emergency braking, lane departure warning with blind spot monitoring, and a surround by camera system. The large wheels on the upper variants of the BMW X5 might make its cabin a little noisier and the ride a little stiffer, but this is still a fantastic all-around performance SUV. As far as on-road performance is concerned, even the entry-level 40i X-Drive does a good job. Its 3.0-liter twin-scroll turbocharged straight-six petrol engine makes 335 horsepower and 450 newton-meters of torque. Mated to this six-cylinder motor is an eight-speed ZF automatic gearbox that spins all four corners. This results in the BMW X5 40i X-Drive going from 0 to 100 kmph in 5.5 seconds, while topping out at 243 kmph. There's also a 50i X-Drive that makes 456 horsepower and 650 newton meters out of a 4.4 liter twin turbo V8. With this V8, the BMW X5 goes from 0 to 100 kmph in just 4.7 seconds and hits a top speed of 250 kmph. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.